This clip is going to explain how to use Atlas Manage Columns to incorporate data from across your database across different periods and different dimensions. You can see on my screen we have a spreadsheet already set up. I've just typed in the filters, the X company, ledger account, main account, and the two periods, and we've got an Atlas list account of our main or ledger accounts. In order to add a Manage Column, I must place my cursor within the Atlas table object open up my definitions for this list report and in the output or the style list I select the header and I right click. This allows me to add the manage column functionality. I'm actually going to add three manage columns and I'm going to rename them by double clicking. The first one is period one, the second one is period two, The third one is the difference column. As I now click update, we can see that three columns have now appended themselves to this Atlas report. So I can now use my Atlas free function, free format function, to return the balance. So I select my table, I map my filters, I actually have a set of filters saved for the general journal account entry table, as I regularly use this table. I map based on my AX company my date, which is for period one, and my main or ledger account, which is in column B. And because I'm going to want to report across multiple fields, I eat all the main accounts, I just use my Excel knowledge to unlock the absolute reference. I then select my output, which is the amount in the accounting currency amount. I click insert, we can see how the table now auto populates I then replicate the formula in column two based on period two. However, again, I'm just going to use Excel to make this a much quicker exercise by dragging the formula across, reopening the formula, and just changing the date so that it's no longer pointing at D4, but it's pointing at E4. As I click update, automatically the data is auto populated. So I can now use this last column to use some Excel functionality to show the difference, the percentage, whatever I choose. Let me just tidy up the formatting. And we now have three columns which are appended. Or three managed columns which are appended. Of course, as soon as I change my filter, we can start to see the real benefit because as the filter expands the data selection and the list, the list report expands accordingly.